Hey, this is Daniel from Crowfly, and in this video, we're going to answer a question on setting up picture-in-picture -picture mode on the Blackmagic Atom TV Studio HD, similar to what you see here. So let me clear these settings so we can get started. Now, when you first open the Atom software control, this is what you see. To begin, we're gonna select upstream key in the side panel here, and then select DVE. At this point, it's helpful to go ahead and enable the upstream key so we can see what we're doing. So I'm going to hit on air and the upstream part of our switcher to turn that on. If you were building this during a real presentation, you'd want to hit the key one button here to build your picture in picture in the preview window. But since you can only see my program feed right now, we're just uh, hitting on air. Now you can see that we've got a picture in picture window here. You can begin by selecting a fill source. I'm just using this camera, but you can input anything that you wanted into there. And next we're going to adjust the size and I'm going to use 0.30. And then we're going, going to adjust the position. I'm gonna use 10 for the X and minus five for the Y. And then finally, you can adjust your border settings. I like to use 0.15 you can change that using the outer width or inner width settings, or you could just turn the border off if you wanted to. And now we have our basic picture in picture built, which can be turned on and off using the upstream key switcher controls. Now this resets every time you close the program. So I've created a macro with these settings that I can run when the program opens to get all my basic settings back where I need them to be. If you have any other questions about the ATEM, or live production in general, feel free to ask away. Thanks for watching.